convince me you're sad about something, like, uh, uh, your, your best friend just left you, you, you have no one now, like, something along the lines of that.
you're talking about being drunk, I just go into, yeah. yeah so I'm guessing you're pretty in. I'm like, oh, oh, my How did you find out? <laughs> stalker. Yeah. <laughs> Bye! The new girl is stalker. I feel like I wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> Okay, I have a theory though about Dr. Mysterio because I know who Dr. Mysterio is in the comics and in it he's like a villain that like uses like these, he uses, basically uses special effects because he, he, he used to be like a stage guy and he just special effects and so what he's actually doing is he's just doing a bunch of stage effects. I'm super excited. <laughs> Does it even have to have fun? I mean, I totally join you guys, but my phone is dead. You're chilling, you're just in the middle of the day. What's that? Eden? Okay, you're going Eden? Yeah. We're cutting out audio. Okay, sure. Oh, we're cutting out audio because of the thing. So it's okay for us to talk as long as we can. Lean on me. All right, it's rolling. Medicine. All right. Are we starting at the very beginning again? Okay. Yes. All right. Film this time. <laughs> I'm a ghost. I can go wherever, whenever I like. I see everything. I'll have to amend my report. You really hold on to the act. What do you want me to do? Talk to Kitty! 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 Say bye now, that's it! Bye. Oh, that's such a cute little meow. Yeah. Whenever I hear other cats meow, it's on my thing. My cats are really loud and annoying. <laughs> so, recording! <laughs> Hi, guys! Welcome! Hi! To the <laughs> premiere of The Cloud Still Stand. We have worked extremely hard on this movie, um, especially our director and producer, Mason Bird. He's definitely put so much work into this. Um, my name is Sarah, I'm the assistant director. Also, I play Georgia in this movie as well. But I would like us to give a warm welcome to our director and producer, and so many other things, um, Mason Bird. Well, I mean, first off, I want to thank you all for coming. Um, but, you know, I mean, I put like Sarah said, I did put a lot of work into this movie. Put about a year and a half into the writing, and then about six months into filming, and a few days into editing, because I'm pretty quick with that. Um, but this movie has been a very, very important project to me. Um, you know, and when, when we lost Ella, you know, that was, that was a heart-shattering moment for me, and I'm this, this movie was, you know, kind of my coping mechanism, and everything about it was, you know, she was on the back of my mind throughout the entire process, and for this movie to be out now, on her birthday, too, you know, thanks for coming. I mean, let's get this movie started. I don't cry for movies, but I don't know. It was. I don't. I don't cry for movies. I really don't. Um, you know, let's just let's hear it for our cast. You know, I'm really proud of these guys. You know, let's get them all down here. Nev, you first. Where you at? There you are. She is the improv master of all the scenes that were never written. You could look through all the scripts and all the scenes that weren't written. Yeah. She nailed perfectly. And I gotta thank her for that one. Um, thank you so much. You did a great <laughs> job. <laughs> well, let's tell you next. Wait, let's have them all stay up for some good picture. Yeah, let's stay up there. <laughs> This one was a difficult, difficult one. <laughs> you know, you know, uh, giving her the uh, 
the email saying, hey, uh, I want you to play the character that uh, kills herself. <laughs> that, was, that was a bit of a hard one for me. I'm like, can you do that? You know? And she did, and she nailed it. And, you know, what she brought to the table was incredible. And I thank you so much. Sarah, next. She was brought in last second. The original cast member for Georgia broke her foot. So uh, we had to recast. And I knew she had a bit of acting background. She was involved with school plays. So I'm like, hey, do you want to take this role? She's like, yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> now we have to uh, have to excuse Eden. She uh, she had to work today, so it's kind of a bummer. But you know, I don't like giving the antagonist character. I really don't. But when I gave it to her, she was she was all right with it, and she, you know, for the little screen time she had, she took the role and she nailed it. So. And finally, Mr. Ian Purser. This one was a new, this one was a weird one. We we're about we we're about two weeks away before we were supposed to start filming, and I'm like, I don't have a lead male yet. What am I gonna do? So I went over to Mr. Bauer, and I'm like. Do you have anyone in mind? And he points over to across the classroom and was like, I don't know, Ian might be interested. So I shout across, hey Ian! Wanna be in a movie? He's like, sure. <laughs> so, you know, I pretty much gave him the role on the spot. And you killed the role. Thank you. Nope. Nope. <laughs> and you know, these guys nailed it till the end. Might have taken some time, a lot of time. Yeah, I'm, I'm grateful for these guys, and I'm glad that we got this movie done because it's an important one, and it's, you know, it's important. That's all I can say. You guys can sit down. Here. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna say something about Mason real quick, okay? Because none of this would have happened without him. He put blood, sweat, and tears into this thing. I mean, script literally did everything. Like, like, usually you have like a whole cast of things to do with this, but this one person put this huge production together. And I know that the cast is so proud of him, and I mean, none of this could have happened without him. And he did an incredible job. So I think we need another round of applause. Yeah. Can you see how many names, how many, how many titles my name was under in the credits? <laughs> Closer to heaven every time I break I feel electric, I'm a little bit closer to heaven This is molding me, cause in the chaos I'm brave